Roy Halliday. Joining us along with Roy, of course, is Phillies General Manager Ruben Amaro, Jr. And Roy, on behalf of the ball club, let me welcome you and your family into our Phillies family. Thank you. Ruben? Thanks, Scott. Uh, clearly, uh, being able to acquire well, one of the finest pitchers in all of baseball is uh, something very special for our organization. And to be able to lock him up for at least uh, four more years and perhaps five, um, again, it's uh, something we're very, very pleased with. And uh, I just want to welcome Roy and his family, Brandy. Uh, congratulations and uh, congratulations to us, I think, <laughs> because uh, we're very, very pleased to have you with us. And uh, let me grab the jersey for you. Okay. That jersey, until today, as mentioned, had belonged to Cliff Lee. So they not only trade pitchers, they also trade pitchers' jerseys. Number 34 goes to Roy Halladay. 32 is what Halliday wore in Toronto, and of course that number long since retired, the number of Steve Carlton here in Philadelphia. We'll start with uh, some comments by Roy, and then we'll open it up for your questions. Roy? Um, I, I, uh, I'd like to start, uh, first of all, by thanking, uh, you know, everybody in Toronto, uh, the fans, the organization, the, the people. Uh, it's been a big part of my life and uh, something I'll never forget. Um, and, uh, you know, I enjoyed my time there. I'm also um, extremely excited about a new chapter and, uh, and having this opportunity to be part of such a, a great organization and uh, you know somewhere that that my family and I are uh, are really looking forward to being a part of not only uh, baseball wise but you know organizationally and in city um, you know it's kind of the the full package for us so we're thrilled about that um, <clears throat> also like to thank uh, you know our representatives CAA Greg uh, Brody Jeff and Ryan um, you know, allowing us to, to be here is, is uh, spectacular and, and uh, can't thank them enough. Uh, my wife and uh, two boys, Braden and Ryan, um, for, for their support and, and uh, you know, making these changes. It's, it can be hard for a family, I think, to, to move from something you don't know. And uh, <clears throat> they're doing that for me and, and giving me the chance to, uh, to go out and, and um, hopefully achieve goals that, uh, you know, I strive for in the game. So thank you. We'll open up your questions. Hey, Roy, you, you could have waited another year. And, I mean, you've seen what pitchers of your, you know, kind of your colleagues have gotten on the open market. What, is, what was it about this situation? What was it about Philadelphia that you decided to, you know, not want to test the market and just free up here? Uh, well, this is this is where we wanted to be. Um, <clears throat> you know, it was a, it was a bottom line for us. Uh, you know, it's um, sorry I'm fighting the cold, um, but it, it was an easy decision for me. I, I think once the opportunity came up um, to be a part of this, it was something I couldn't pass up. And uh, you know, I, I think there's you know things not only in in business but in life that um, you know are worth it and. And for me, this was one of those things. So, um, you know, there, there's so many positives to this for me and my family. Um, I just couldn't pass it up. Two Cy Young Award winners are on the move as Cliff Lee has been traded to Seattle and Roy Halladay lands in Philadelphia. The two ace pitchers switched teams Wednesday with the completion of a complicated four-team trade. The Blue Jays sent Halliday to the Phillies for three minor leaguers, including right-hander Kyle Drabeck and outfielder Michael Taylor. As part of the deal, Halliday agrees to a three-year, $60 million extension through 2013. The defending NL champion Phillies sent Lee to Seattle for three prospects. The Blue Jays then sent Taylor to Oakland for minor league third baseman Brett Wallace. A 2003 Cy Young winner, Halliday went 17 and 10 last season with the Jays. He had a 2.79 ERA and an AL leading nine complete games in 32 starts. Lee was the reigning AL Cy Young winner when the Phillies got him from Cleveland on July 29th. 
The 31-year-old lefty went 7-4 and four with a 3.39 ERA down the stretch and then excelled in the postseason, going 4-0 and with a 1.56 ERA in five starts. He had two wins against the Yankees in the World Series. Lee has one year and $9 million remaining on his contract, and talk of an extension with Seattle beyond 2010 was not part of the trade discussions. John Klobuchar, The Associated Press.